Hello, I'm going to do a review today on some portable pencil sharpeners. Uh, this is the one that I've been using for a couple years now. This one I just got this Christmas. Um, I actually had it on my wish list and somebody bought it for me. So it's really small, but it's battery operated. So I guess still electric, but portable. So I do a lot of drawing and I tend to, there's another one I just did. And I tend to um, do a lot of drawing when I'm traveling. So like, if I'm taking a kid somewhere, uh, like to Taekwondo, or I'm taking another kid to do space or whatever, they do their thing and I do my thing, which is drawing. And obviously, since I primarily use pencil, um, that requires a lot of sharpening. And so I use pencil sharpeners very frequently. So first, um, I'm going to talk about this one. This is the Boston Twist and Sharp, and it's still good. Um, I still really like it. It comes with, there's like a little lever here, and I don't know why they have this, but they do. So you can turn it straight up and down, and I know you can't see it probably, maybe you can. There's a picture of a blunt edge or a blunt tipped pencil, or you can turn it this way and get a sharp tip. I have no idea why I would use the blunt one, but they have it so as a feature. So somebody uses it. And then, um, so you just twist, twist, twist. And then when you've got it full and it fills up really quick, you just open the little hatch here, empty it out. I've got some stuff stuck in the back there. You can see, but basically you just empty it out, close the lid and you're ready to go again. This one, um, is pretty similar. You just pop in your two AA batteries. You put your pencil in the top, it turns, and then you're done. This one also doesn't have a lot of uh, space for shavings, maybe a little bit more than this one, but not much. And then when you're done, this front piece, there, it comes off like that, empty it in the trash, and you're good to go. This one kind of has the advantage that you can really get in there to um, remove all the shavings that the other one is a little bit harder to clean out um, than this one is. And so there you go. So um, I'm going to actually demonstrate them for you. So I've got two pencils here that are kind of dull. I like having a really sharp point when I'm drawing. So this one, all you do is you push it in and then you kind of like that. It's not like you don't have to turn it, turn it, turn it. You just ratchet like that. And then you've got a sharp, sharp tip. I think we could probably get a little bit sharper. There we go. So that's how that one works. This one is a lot easier, obviously. And there you go. So I like them both, but I still have to say if I'm traveling, I'm still going to take this one just because it's smaller and it's lighter weight and it doesn't make any noise. So this one still wins, but I still, um, I actually find myself using this one when I'm at home rather than my big, I have a huge plug-in one. Um, and I actually have started using this one instead of the huge plug-in one because this one travels with me to any room in the house that I happen to be drawing in. So um, I like them both, but I still like this one better uh, for travel. 